With one job down and another just starting, this has become senior Janae Gardner new reality of living paycheck to paycheck. I've been having a job since 15. I've been working. Um, in high school, I came to college, worked two jobs. Like, I've been working. A lot of people tell me, girl, you, you just work, work, and work, and work, and I'm like, I get it from my father. <laughs> when Janae's not flipping pizza or rolling dough, she works as an athletic trainer for LSU Sports. Her future at the university is in question after learning that she's no longer eligible for the state's four-year scholarship program, TOPS, which funded her tuition the past couple of years. It was going to be about around $11,000. And that's money that Janae doesn't have. 15 years ago, her mother was forced to walk away from work after battling multiple sclerosis, prompting her father to carry the load. I couldn't really, you know, depend on my parents to help me pay for college. They turned me down for financial aid because they say my father made too much. But at the end of the day, if he's working two jobs, then how can he help me? I tried to do funding through loans and I got turned down for every single loan I applied for. <laughs> and so I had to do something. So she sat down and created a GoFundMe account. And hours later, donations started pouring in with two big contributions coming from Leonard Fournette and Darius Geis, who felt inspired after seeing her story on Twitter. She was my trainer in LSU. You know, she took care of me when I needed massages. She's from my hometown and I mean, why not? You know, give back to where I'm from. When I saw that tweet, I was actually here at Lit working, and um, I just started crying. They had to send me home because I, <laughs> I, I couldn't stop crying. I can't even thank everybody enough. So because of these people um, that helped me, that I'll be able to finish my last year in school. As those tears of joy dry up, Janae Gardner is no longer worried about how this story ends, thanks to a random act of kindness. In my life, I live by, if you do the right things, good things will come to you. And they certainly have. Jordan James, WFB, Nine Sports.